I am Dr. Chandrani, obstetrician and gynecologist in Neotia Bhagirathi Women and Child Care Center, Newtown. Today, I am going to discuss about a very important topic, which is postmenopausal bleeding from vagina. Now, to understand this topic, first we need to know what menopause is. When in a woman's life there is no period for 12 months due to age-related decline in the ovarian function. That period is called menopause. In India, the average age of menopause is 50 years. So, any bleeding after this period, that is uh, after menopause, is called postmenopausal bleeding from vagina. Now, the important thing is, many women can't make out where is this bleeding coming from. They just notice some uh, spotting or some bleeding in their undergarments, but they fail to make out whether it is coming from the urinary tract or the vagina or the back passage so ever if you notice any bleeding from after your menopause then you must go to your doctor at an earliest why we are so concerned about it because in 10 percent of women having this postmenopausal bleeding from the vagina they will have some form of cancer from the lining of the womb that is in the uterus or in the cervix but the good thing is in 90% of the women, the cause is non-cancerous. It may be due to age-related thinning in the lining of the vagina. It may be due to polyp in the uterus or the endometrium. Or it may be due to some medications, which we will call hormone replacement therapy. That is due to effect of some hormonal medication, there are bleeding. So when you go to your doctor, your doctor will take your detailed history, like your medication history, the doctor will offer you some in, uh, examinations. You may also be offered some internal examination to uh, see the source of this bleeding, that whether it is from the vagina or not. Then you will be offered some tests, that is investigation. One important investigation is pap smear, which looks into the cells of the lining of the neck of the womb. And other test is ultrasound. This ultrasound may be done abdominally or may be done vaginally. In the ultrasound, we look at the thickness of the lining of the womb. If it is more than 4 mm, then it is a thick endometrium. And then you will be offered for the testing, that is biopsy. This kind of biopsy is usually done in the OT under the guidance of a camera, that is called hysteroscopy guided biopsy. That means a camera will be introduced through your vagina, the lining of the womb will be seen and then biopsy will be taken. Depending upon the results, you will be offered treatment. So don't get scared. Whenever you have any postmenopausal bleeding, go to your doctor because that 10% woman who will have uh, the cause as a cancer, the earlier the treatment, better is the cure. And in the other 90%, you will be offered treatment depending upon your cause. You can be offered some medication, you can be offered stoppage of some medication or some other small procedures like removal of polyp. Thank you.